yourself be weak, Mother. I know that lesson well. And never be? Taken by surprise. Don't apply these principles to fencing, you'll never be as good as Adrian Agress. Adrian? Don't worry, Mother. I've got everything I need to succeed with him. Patrol's over, Bugaboo. Claws in. So your favorite cheese is missing from the plate and it's as if the others don't exist? Try another type. You might be surprised how much you like it. Miss Kagami Tsurugi called to inform you that the time of your fencing lesson has been changed to one hour earlier this week. Huh. Thank you, Natalie. Kagami, Kagami. All these scheduling changes requested by the aggressor are annoying, but you can use it to fit in another hour of Russian. Yes, Mother. All these scheduling changes requested by the Tsurugi are annoying. When you get home, make sure you try on the outfit I've just completed for your next photo shoot. Yes, Father. Kagami? Adrian? Your fencing class doesn't start for an hour. And Mr. Dajankor hasn't arrived yet. Oh, really? And I was sure I wrote down the correct hour this time. Mm, I'm sorry, but you can't... Stay at school without adult supervision? No problem, Mr. Hepperell. We'll come back for the class in an hour. What are you up to this time? The arts and crafts room? What are you planning to do in here? I've never told this to anyone, but I love to draw. I always have. Drawings never lie. The poses that people make are always a reflection of their personality, but my mother won't let me do it. According to her, I'm not good enough. You're super talented, Kagami. You really think so? Mm-hmm. Pose for me. I want to sketch you. How do you want me to pose? However makes you comfortable. I really admire Toulouse Lautrec. I'd like to draw you like the characters he painted. Did you know he often signed his paintings with a monogram like many Japanese artists did? This isn't right. It's not you. Can I see it? Try a different pose. Hmm? It should be easy to do a beautiful sketch of you because you are so handsome. But what I want is to capture the real you inside. No, still not good. Change again. Hmm? These are all modeling poses. Try something that's more natural. More you. What about meow? Uh, I mean, no. <laughs> no, you're not at all natural. Yes, I am. I promise. This is me. No, that's you when you're being silly. What if when I'm being silly, I'm really me? There. This is really you. Do you really think? Yes, you're perfect. Now it's really time for our fencing class. On guard! Play! Alley! Touché. On guard. Uh, sorry, I forgot something back in the locker room. And now, time for camouflage. Do you always carry these things with you? Of course, I have to be re I mean, you have to be ready for any opportunity whenever you run into Adrian. Everything is retractable and folds up neatly, even this fancy ball gown. You'll be needing it when you get back together with Adrian. Huh, here are the swimsuits. No time to lose. I bet you're already starting to fall in love with him again. No. That's just because you haven't seen him in action yet. Action! Your pigeon isn't up for the job. He's not supposed to come back with a rose. The sneeze frightened him. I told you I'm allergic to pigeons. Achoo! Did you see how handsome he is? Did you feel your heart beat faster? Did you get the shivers tingled in your fingers? <sighs> what I felt was sorry for that poor pigeon tamer. It's because you haven't looked into each other's eyes yet. Oh, I've got an idea. Here for your allergy to the dugs. <laughs> What are you doing? Put me down right now! I'm helping your eyes meet! There! He's looking at you! Look at him! Look at him! This 
cannot be happening. How complicated is it to deliver a rose in mid-flight to a model in mid-dive? It's all my fault. I thought I saw one of my friends from school. Well, I don't see anyone except a stupid bird that's incapable of doing what it's been asked to do and that's gonna get banned from all of Paris if it continues to ruin the rehearsals for my commercial! <laughs> no, Marinette, I didn't feel anything except shame for me, for Adrian, and for this ridiculously embarrassing situation. I'm leaving. But it's because you were too far apart. It's when you're close together that you really feel it. Oh, <gasps> I got an idea. Are you ready? Of course. Remember, Edgar, if Mr. Roth is happy, he'll have a word with the mayor, and pigeons will live in Paris happily ever after. Action! Marinette, stop it! This is completely crazy! Love is crazy, so stop thinking so much and dive in! <laughs> Marinette? Video, dude. You guys were awesome. I wasn't Nino. I messed up the intro. We can go over it again if you want, Adrian. Yeah, let's play it again. Adrian, it's time. Five more minutes? Mm-mm. Well, I'll be better next time, I promise. See you guys. Cars aren't here yet. That's too bad. We could have played the song again. But this way we have a little time together. We'll have plenty of time together when we go to Prince Ali's birthday. Together, just the two of us, I mean. Uh, I'm so happy when I'm with you. I have a feeling we're a lot alike. Uh, Do you feel the same way? Do you also? Uh, sorry, I thought I saw a wasp. Do you love me too? Excuse me? Adrian, what's going on? I forgot something on the barge when my bag fell. Don't wait up for me. Let's meet up at Prince Ali's birthday. Tatsu, take me to the city hall. I hope we can still celebrate Ali's birthday. Fancy parties always have the best cheese boards. Later, but right now Ladybug needs me. Flag, claws out! his power with the peacocks to become Shadow Moth. He created a supervillain and a scent monster at the same time. I need you out here. Now you must tell the truth to anyone who asks you a question. I'll do the honors. Who are you, Ladybug? I am... A super swimmer! <sighs> Dear Prince Ali, on behalf of the city of Paris, we all wish you a very happy birthday. Didn't I arrange with Gabriel Agreste that his son would accompany you here? Oh, um, he's here, Mother. A journalist's interviewing him outside. I'll go and find him. Woohoo! Ah, <sighs> lady, it's been a while since I've had that much fun. <laughs> if battling a supervillain with three eyes and a giant monster buddy is your idea of fun, I can't imagine what your other days are like. A baddie, a scent monster, and Shadow Moth. It's even more exciting with his new name, don't you think? He can change his name as often as he likes. He'll still never win. You can count on me and my jokes, Bugaboo. Well, you don't have to overdo it. Truth is, I only ever have this much fun with you. Catch you later! Cross <laughs> <laughs> it! Kagami, I hope I didn't keep you waiting too long. And I hope you found what you were looking for. Huh? Back at the barge. Uh, on the barge, right. Yeah, I found it. Thank you. What was it? Oh, you know, just that thing, that lucky charm that Marinette gave me. Uh, no, did I lose it? Uh, again? You mean this one? <gasps> you know, I lied too. I lied to my mother so we could see each other. I even lied to her when I said you came here with me tonight. I lied at every fencing lesson, so we could spend more time together. You see, we're both a couple of liars. Except I lie, because I want to be with you. You lie, because you don't want to be with me. 
you call me? I'll go in first. On guard! Play! Allez! <laughs> This is a fencing class here, not a joust. Fall out! I'm really sorry I hurt you, Kagami. You know, all those wonderful times we had together, they weren't lies. I know. I know that you're hiding something. But I also know that there is sincerity in you, too. So, can we still be friends? How can you trust someone who's lied to you? When I'm ready to see you again, I'll let you know.